Jacksport says operations at the port supports more than 26,000 jobs here in Jacksonville, and it's only getting better. That's right, board members say that the Harbor Deepening Project is a part of significant growth in just the last five years. New this noon, Action News Jack's Brittany Donovan explains how a local business owner shows us the port supports his business. Jacksport provides thousands of families in Jacksonville good paying jobs, including the truckers you see turning into the terminal right now. But it's not only people who work at the port. These jobs also support the local economy, including Jeff Ferris restaurant, the Portside Grill. Jeff Ferris says Portside Grill is known for its home cooked flavors and fried chicken. Usually uh, when the port peak time is at peak time, I'm at peak time. So um, there's no doubt it, there's a symbiotic relationship here. Farah tells me he chose the spot on Talleyrand because of Jacksport's growth. On Monday, a maritime research firm revealed new data showing the port supports 26,000 jobs in the Jacksonville area. That includes 10,876 people who work at the port, making an average of $70,500 per year. At the end of the day, they've been able to give a quality of life to their family that they've all been looking for. Vincent Cameron says he's seen an uptick, and it'll be even greater when dredging is complete in 2023. With more containers come more economic um, opportunities that spread throughout the community. Jack Sports Board says harbor deepening has contributed to the nearly 8% job growth since 2013. For Farah, he says it's good jobs for families. That means I made a good decision, um, and I'll continue to invest in my business as well. Right now, the Portside Grill is hiring, and Farah says that's because of the steady stream of customers he sees here in Talleyrand. Ahead at five, the growth he says he's seen since opening nearly two years ago. Reporting in Duval County, Brittany Donovan, CBS 47, Action News Jacks.